Hi guys, one of the ways here, back again for another video on the channel. This one today then is Huddersfield home. I think it's our final Saturday 3pm game of the season uh, at the Swansea.com stadium. So it's, yeah, it's been quite a quick season to be honest. I know we've had the World Cup break and stuff, but it still feels like the season's gone very, very quickly. Um, in terms of today's game, again, not really an important one for the Swans. We're literally playing for nothing but pride and yeah, forming towards next season. But for Huddersfield, big game for them. They're trying to stay up. Neil Warnock obviously in charge now. Huddersfield on their third manager of the season. But Warnock has uh, revolutionised Huddersfield, to be honest. He's got them scoring goals, defending pretty well. And yeah, they've been picking up points of late. They've beat Watford away from home, which is a great result for them. They drew last week to Blackburn, but they were 2-0 up, so it's probably points dropped in that one. But still a decent point in the end. But yeah, Huddersfield at the relegation zone at the moment at the time of recording. But it's so tight down there. And any bad result for Huddersfield today could mean they're back in the bottom three at half past five. So yeah, be an interesting one today then. Of course, obviously we want to win. But, you know, Cardiff will want us to win as well. We'll actually have to do them a favour with Huddersfield. But I'm not too focused on them, to be honest, because at the end of the day, I still want to see my football team win, regardless of what goes in the opposite direction. Obviously, again, you know, people, you know, it's a big game. Huddersfield, like I said, managed by Neil Warnock. Of course, he's an ex-Cardiff City manager. Of course, did play against Swansea as Cardiff manager, and he lost 1-0 thanks to Ben Watts' goal. So, yeah, I feel like, you know, there'll be a bit of, Chant in towards Neil Warnock as is expected. And Neil Warnock loves the abuse anyway, so he'll probably be singing along to the songs anyway. But yeah, should be an interesting one. Don't think there's going to be too many goals in the game with Huddersfield's defensive setup today. I just feel like they're going to be sitting back. I don't even think they're going to press, as I just think they're going to try and hit some of the counter attack and use set pieces as, you know, that is Warnock football. And, you know, I'm not going to hear you criticize it. At the end of the day, football's a results game, regardless of how you play. Fans don't really care about the three points. So, yeah, be a tough one today then. Hopefully the lineup's good. Be interested to see who plays today after we win a few changes against Wigan and comfortably beat them on Monday. Like I said, didn't go to the game. Didn't fancy doing a watch long either as I was in bed with a cold. So, yeah, we just would be me sniffing 24-7. But, yeah, beat Wigan Monday. Pretty easy game, to be honest. Pro of an Atrick, Wigan with Paul. But I don't think... It'll be as easy as what reverse Monday against this Huddersfield team. I think they'll be part for a fight. And yeah, we're going to have to perform if we want anything out of this one. So just walking to the ground now. So one team has been announced. One change from our 2-0 victory at the DW Stadium on Monday afternoon. Uh, Liam Cullen back in the side. Joanne drops to the bench. No Walsh again. Hopefully it's not an injury. Hopefully he's just being uh, rested because Walsh has been brilliant recently. Huddersfield's team... Yeah, not bad. Just had no vacation. I should have like the 4-1 up, so uh, that's lovely to see. But yeah, strong game today. Hopefully uh, we can get the win. I'm going to go for Swansea E2, Huddersfield nil. Joel Pro and Liam Cullen on the score sheet. Like I said, we've got to do Cardiff a favour today, but I'd rather Swans win than anything else, so yeah. Labor, a good ball, and then Cullen nearly gets his foot in it. Good clearance away. Still nil nil, but also ones that have to expect full possession. But Huddersfield, they wouldn't mind the draw, to be fair. That's it. Come on. Come on. Oh. Go on. Oh. Good work by Enchamp. Deserve the finish at the end of it. Still nil nil. Good all swans. Still come close from the corner. Keep leaving this one free at the back post. Goes head on to that just wide. Still no little three minutes gone, as you expect, really. Sorry, right, we scored in fault on it, the wall. Yeah. Oh, yeah! I don't know, that's not gone in. See, it was Cardiff, really. Good free kick, which hits the wall. Second ball back in. And uh, not too sure that stayed out, to be honest. Still no little. Nearly half hour gone. Slow, slow game, but like I said, we expect Huddersfield to sit back and get anything possible. Oh. Best chance of the game, to be honest with that. Nice work from the throw-in. Ball into the box from Danny Moore to this volley door. Such good power on us, to be honest. Still no nil, probably best chance of the game, really. Again, it's slow going forward, but still second half. We've got some zombie 
That was a really good chance, obviously, and we could have taken the lead there. Go on! Someone hit it! Oh! Oh! Kirsty managed to catch up for the game, unfortunately. Um, what do you think of the half then? Nil nil. Uh, nothing much to shout about, really. I just feel sitting back, we're passing around all the time. And opportunities, I think we should have shot, but we didn't. Seems afraid to shoot a minute. But second half, I hope it gets a bit better. But I'll be happy if we keep our unbeaten run going, to be honest with you. And yeah, nothing else to talk about, really. No, not been great. But did you enjoy Wigan Monday? Yeah, I gotta say, very good results. Two yeah. nil winners. Fans were terrible, the pies were brilliant. And yeah, yeah. I said that. Uh, cheers. Cheers. Nil little half time, not much to shout about. One good chance for either side, but apart from that, nothing much. Yeah, playing the Huddersfield's tactics a little bit, they'll be up the half, keeping it solid. They'll have a clean sheet and point is better than nothing for them at the end of the day in a relegation battle, especially after that card result earlier. But hopefully, we can get something in the second half, get an early goal. I'd bring someone like Whitaker on a bit of pace, power on the uh, wing and someone who can shoot. But yeah, nil nil, not a great half, but still ch time to change that. Go on, Ryan. Go on. Go on. Go on. Go on. Give it. I just feel to be down to 10 men, John Flogger just fell past and it's an easy yellow card but because he's already got one he's not going to get another one. It's one of those really anyway, if he's not been bucked he gets a yellow there. Frustrating, double sub, Whitaker and Cumberland come on but it's so frustrating really because any other player who's not getting one has a yellow card and he doesn't get bucked, it's frustrating. Yeah, no I do agree, that's how Go on! Exactly why I wanted Whitaker going to start this game, to be honest, because I said he can cut inside, great stuff, and shoot, and it nearly goes in. Good luck, Abe. Go on, Cundall. Hit it! Go on, Cundall. Hit it! A luck on the strike, huge deflection of Ryan Manning's shot. Might go down his ankle, might go down his own goal, too sure. But 1 0. Taking about 70 minutes to get the deadlock. Broke them, but we've done it. A bit of luck needed, but that's what happens when you're at the ball. My country's still there. You just don't seem to get any luck. And I've seen it when we've been in the primary, just getting absolutely terrible goals because they against us. So I do feel kind of sorry for them. But I do realise I've got Neil Walker manager and he used to manage our rivals. So yeah, 1 0. Come on. A Jack is a Jack, Ryan Manning is a Jack, he ain't got it. Go on! Yo! This is what I mean, when we get the first, we need to get the second, third, and kill the game off. And that's what we're trying to do, lap boarding just wide, but yeah, Huddersfield chasing the game now. Come on then. Go on! Oh. Another great ball. Oh, really to get a second there, to kill a game off. Obviously, I haven't really often out except Mark, but one of those famous goalies in football, and these corners by Manning are brilliant. See, so you get our head to it. Oh, fuck. Go on, Whitaker. Yes! Right. Five minutes to go, Swansea run, Huntsville nil. Yeah, big last five, ten minutes for Huntsville to try and get something. With four games left on the season to go. Come here, everyone. Five minutes added on then. See if we can hang on here. Yeah. What? Late free kick to Huntsfield. Not soft, but. Oh, last chance then to get equaliser. Good position as well. Woo! Way! Well done! Well, that was a bit anticlimactic to be fair, but you know, we've asked him about 90 minutes we've seen this season. 
Well, bound to be nervous, but still a couple of minutes left. I think the rescue bucks there. He's only now got the ball again, but oh well, still 1 0. All time at Swansea.com Stadium, Swansea City 1, Huddersfield Town 0. Three points for the Swans, which extends our one beaten run. Four wins in five now, I believe. So, yeah, really good form. It's a shame that, you know, we're not going to get playoffs at the end of the day. We might point to drop the season's frustrating. But, fair play to the players. You know, we've had such a difficult spell and ever since our Cardiff City game, really. Um, we've turned the switch and really, you know, got what we wanted towards the end of the season. We've got three, four games left now, I believe. Preston... Uh, midweek, then we got trips to Norwich, Hull, and then West Brom or Holmes. Yeah, quite difficult games to end off the season with, really. But hopefully, just build some momentum towards next season. Big loss for Huddersfield there. I thought they were quite poor today, to be honest. Defensively, you know, as you expect, pretty solid, but offered nothing going forward. And, you know, as soon as we scored that first goal, you just knew Huddersfield weren't going to get anything out of that game because they just offered nothing. But that's the problem. We're in that relegation battle. <laughs> Every point's vital. And, yeah, I've just seen Huddersfield got Sunderland away next, which is a tough, tough game. But, yeah, playoff race is heating up mass. Uh, automatic salute only five points being chef of United relegation battles immense now Blackpool could stay up potentially as well so yeah it's really exciting it's just a shame that's something that you aren't involved in the first two I mentioned the playoffs and the automatics but maybe next season but yeah really good performance today uh, took us a while to get that first goal to be honest but yeah brilliant strike from Manning and it's just a shame you won't be here next season but you know fair play hopefully the board can back Martin in the summer because I truly believe if we can get some back in keep players like Nathan Wood Joel Pro, Matt Grimes again then we'll definitely have a chance to play off next season. It's all about consistency and, you know, Martin needs help, the players need help and that comes down to the owners. So, yeah, the players couldn't have done much more this season, really. We've got a young squad. Uh, Fisher, again, really good game today. Didn't have much to do, but, you know, what he had to do, he did well. But, yeah, like I said, it's all about the owners really backing this team because we're backing, you know, we've got potential. But, yeah, February Martin, good subs as well. Um, yeah. All round decent day to be fair, and card of loss. So, yeah, always good to see. So, yeah, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed, please leave a like, comment, subscribe, and yeah, best luck to Huddersfield for the rest of the season.